Have you ever wondered why you feel like you're making the same mistakes over and over again each month? Are you upgrading your lifestyle based on social pressure rather than need? Are you telling yourself that you'll start saving more money when you earn more money? Here are two helpful explanations that help me understand what was going on in my mind. Let's jump right in to the two common reasons. Number one, overspending and lifestyle inflation. Number two, not starting to save early. What resonated with me was the explanation through behavioral psychology. Behavioral psychology is a subfield that specifically focuses on observable behavior and how they are shaped by the environment. Overspending and lifestyle inflation. The question is, are you spending more because your income has increased rather than focusing on adjusting your savings goal? Here, the psychological concept of present bias. This is the tendency to prioritize current and present benefits over future benefits. So overvaluing immediate rewards over future ones tend to lead us to spending more on material goods and experiences without considering the long-term effects of future savings or investing. A simple example now is rushing out to buy the latest iPhone 16 when your current phone is working just fine. Number two, not starting to save early enough. Are you putting off saving for retirement because it feels far away? So the psychological concept behind this is hyperbolic discounting. It's quite similar to the earlier concept of present bias. But in this case, hyperbolic discounting means discounting future value leading to procrastination. So since we know the compounding effect isn't apparent today, but in the future, the compounding effect is significant over time. And the problem here is that we are discounting future rewards by a lot. The future feels so distant. So there is no urgency to save now. The example of this is delaying setting up a retirement fund or a retirement nest egg because retirement seems so far away. So this ignores how early savings and investing can compound over time, which is very detrimental to your long-term plan. Understanding these two behavioral traps helped me as a young adult to make more conscious decisions and inform financial choices. If this was relevant to you, please like and comment for me to cover more psychological biases. Lastly, being aware is just the first step. You have to take a conscious decision to take action today.